How's the shooting for everybody? Uh, shooting's been, it's been fun. You know, um, a lot of people knock it down shots. Some of my time is young. Uh, the people that we're counting on to make shots are making shots. And that's the biggest thing. But everybody's working hard, so we'll come around. Actually, you guys just ready to play a game in front of you. Yeah, definitely. I mean, everybody's excited to get the season going. Practice, you know, practice is war, three hours, so we're definitely ready to get out there and you know, put it to use. About Dev, talk about him. I know the guy you've been boosting and pumping up a little bit. How's he been playing? Dev's been great. I mean, he's definitely been making his home in the paint. That's something that we definitely need him to do this year. He's been leading and stepping up. I'm talking a lot to the guys, especially the bigs that had to sit out last year. So uh, he's been more of a leader this year. He's been more vocal uh, and he's maturing a lot. Well, does it feel like a better defensive team? Do you think you guys are? Yeah, I think we're better defensively. Um, a lot of the guys we brought in are, you know, extra athletic. So they make up for a, a lot of stuff we didn't have in the past. You know, a lot of block shots, reading the passing lane, you know, and just guarding a man one on one. We have a good team this year defensively, better than we've had in the past. You think those new guys are going to be able to help them? I know last year we got ganged up on a little bit. Are those guys going to take some more pressure off him? Yeah, definitely. That, that, um, John, Elijah, Brandon, even Brandon, I mean. But especially John and Elijah, um, both of them will be, I feel like, impact players from the start. Uh, they give us a lot of stuff that we didn't have last year. They're both competitors. They play hard and they have a lot of skills. So I think they'll definitely complement that. Down there. Give you stuff you didn't have, you mean defensively, offensively? Both. Yeah. Last year we were just limited to Dev, basically. Uh, this year we have two more scoring threats. Uh, they help us on the defensive end, they block shots, and they just make a difference in the game. Well, I know there's not a whole lot you can say about the scrimmage from Saturday, but was there anything that, that surprised you, or maybe that you guys were better than what you thought, or worse than what you thought out there? Anything? Uh, I'm not really, I'm not allowed to talk about the scrimmage, so. <laughs> John, what's what's been the learning curve been like for these some of these junior college guys? Have they come along a little bit faster than you thought, or what's the deal with that? Yeah, in my opinion, um, they're coming along very fast. You know, it's hard to to learn all the concepts that we have here. We have so many, uh, and I'm sure they're different than a lot of schools. But you know, they're picking them up fast. Um, they're eager to be out here, uh, giving 110 percent, and that's the easy. I mean, that's that's the hard part right there is giving it your all. You know, as long as you play hard, everything else will fall into place, and I think that's what's happening. What about leadership you've taken personally with uh, this group? Uh, well, I've just tried to talk to them a lot. Um, you know, that you know, it's the coach's job, primary job, to do the yelling. So uh, I try to come in and you know, give them an extra voice, or just tell them another way to look at it, and you know, try to encourage them a little bit more, especially with the guards, uh, Javon and Dax and Tariq. Just try to stay in their ear a lot because they're going to be handling the ball a lot. So. Um, just trying to let them know everything that I know that could help them out and uh, you know, ways to stay out of out of trouble on the court. Do you go out of your way a lot to, to talk with these guys, the new ones and the ones that have been with you? Yeah, I, I would say so. You know, um, Especially if I see a guy is kind of down on himself, I know he's better than what he's playing. I just try to tell him, you know, just play your game. Don't try to think too much. Just let it be natural. Just because I feel like that works the most for me. So uh, just try to step in and encourage him a little bit. One, two years ago, the team didn't handle adversity all that well. Last year, there were you know good good points, bad points. Th this team, what's your gut feeling on on how this team will handle adversity and, and down points in the season? Um, well, our guys are very competitive this year. I would say more competitive than we've been in the past. So I think that's one factor that'll help us a lot. I think we have better athletes and, and better um, natural players. So I feel like that'll help us. Some situations that we struggled in last year, and then leadership. You know, we don't have much leadership, but um, I play. I've been playing. Gary's been playing. So it's going to take guys like us, even Devin, to step up and show everybody else how how things supposed to go. Steve was talking about having better chemistry. Does that help when it comes to you know things like that? Yeah, chemistry definitely yeah. helps. I mean, when you know somebody on and off the court or their tendency. Uh, it helps you understand them better. Um, helps you kind of guess, guess what they're going to be thinking about. Or I mean, it all meshes well when you. Well, they're playing together. Are you seeing that team, the guys playing together, even the new guys? Yeah, I would say we're playing together well. Um, we've been making a lot of extra passes, um, and that's something that doesn't usually happen early because everybody's usually trying to go for theirs. But uh, we've been having a, a unselfish practices, you know, guys getting each other open and um, looking for each other more. So I would say, yeah, we've been playing very unselfish, playing together.
Kiwan, how about you yourself? I mean, I know you've been to a bunch of camps this summer, and what were some of the things um, that they wanted you to work on, things that you've seen in your game that you want to work on specifically? Uh, well, definitely want to improve, keep improving my outside shot. Um, but one of the biggest things that uh, I learned over the summer was just how to be a complete point guard um, on and off the court. As far as being a leader, uh, trying to be the extension of a coach on the floor, you know, knowing how to encourage your teammates, when to get on them, when to pick them up. Um, that's mostly what I've learned this summer, just being around a lot of guys with experience and uh, a lot of guys telling you what's going to be needed for you to make it at the next level. How much can things get better for you personally? I mean, being the big 12 and scoring last year, how can that be for you? Um, well, first thing, we can win more games. You know, that's our main focus. I'm not really concerned with my personal accolades, just as far as I'm, I want to get the team better. You know, I want to do something that we haven't done, well, I haven't done personally, which is play in the NCAA tournament. So um, that's my main focus, and I'm just want, I want to do anything I can to help the team get there. So I'm not really focused on personal.